Hello, and I am Clayton Mueller, and this is my henna hair update, because it has been five ever since I dyed it henna, and want to give you guys my thoughts about, um, I just put it away, Light Mountain Natural Hair Color and Conditioner in Spicy Cinnamon. Um, ooh. Anyways, um... I think it was March or April when I did my last henna treatment, and it's been about a year since I did my first henna treatment, which was not even a red color, it was a dark brown. And then I used the foxed one, which is red, and then I used the red panda, which is spicy cinnamon. And after a while, I get bored, and that's just my nature. I get bored of hair colors. It's like, oh, I kind of want to go blonde again, and I don't know, I want to go see that color. Every single color I want to be on, on that spectrum. That makes sense. Um, but yeah, so after some research, I noticed that some hennas have, I think it's metallic salts, correct me if I'm wrong, or just, I'm just going to say metallics. And then that can be bad reactions if you're trying to use chemical dyeing processes. I've read that you can have your hair catch on fire, your hair turn blue and green. So I'm like, mm. and Light Match and Natural doesn't have any of that, but to be safe side, I use Sun In, which is like a bleaching, baby bleaching, I guess, to slowly lighten. I did that for about a, a month. And it got it pretty light. It's heat activated apparently, and you just spray it in hydrogen peroxide and it lightens your hair. And so this is like the hair lightened. Let's get like, mm, 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 mm. I don't know if you can see a difference. I thought I saw a difference. Um, But yeah, that was henna with sun in. And so I think it's safe to say that I can use a chemical process but should i probably not so i probably won't because i like how healthy my hair is right now so i probably will just let it grow out have some epic rootage and go from there and oh these are just ear cuffs but yeah four months after henna that's what it looks like um let me know what you guys think about my hair if I should go blonde again, I would never go platinum again. That is too scary. My hair after that was gummy. After it being wet, like it go woo woo woo. So never again. Um, <sighs> besides that, just been in school and fantasizing about what kind of hair I want, and just working on my photography and trying to upload videos that I would like to see other people do, if that makes sense. So, funny ones, hair ones, makeup ones, um, I don't know if my highlighters do, because I probably sorted it all off during hip-hop class, because we are doing house-style hip-hop right now, and it's very light on your feet, and fast, and I am tired, and I'm breaking out, and I think all my highlighters are gone, but I still got my ear cuffs. And my eyebrows look kind of good. Getting them done next week again. But yeah. This is henna hair. It's pretty. It's awesome. Um, yeah. And again, I used Light Mountain. Right? Light Mountain Natural and Spicy Cinnamon. Gotta get that thumbnail. Depressed thumbnail. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about henna and hair, makeup, because I really want to get a Jeffree Star um, highlighter palette. And um, this series right now with Shane Dawson is pretty fun, and you guys should watch that too. But yeah, this is henna again, hair. I used sun in, and oh, there it is sun in bottles empty but it's a hair lightener and i think it i think it worked baby lightning wasn't any 
harsh, harsh, harsh processing. But yeah, that's it. See you guys later. Bye.